Hi, and welcome to Makeup Mug What? My name is Leanne. Thank you so much for joining me. I have a quick new product that I just picked up tonight, and I want to try it with you to see how we like it. So I was in CVS picking up a couple products for another video that I'm doing. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And they had a display of Honest Beauty. And I snagged the Cream, Everything Cream Foundation. And it is in the shade, oh, Snow. It's up there in the top corner. It's in the shade Snow. And this says it has buildable coverage, a velvety finish, and seamless blendability. Okay, so it's in a compact, well, square compact, beautiful. Has a mirror. And then here is, I swatched it real quick. That's not someone else's dirty swatch. That's my dirty swatch. So here it is. Here she blows. And it looks a little peachy. We'll see how it goes. I don't have, ooh, I don't have any primer on. And I don't think I'm going to put any primer on. I think we're just going to try it on my face. I mean, I have moisturizer on. Um, so let's try it with... What kind of brush? I know I'm going to like finish it with a sponge. Hold on, I'm going to get a brush. Hold on. You just hold on. Hold on a second. I'm going to get a brush. Hold on. Will this work? Let's get this brush. Whoa, baby. She's deformed. Oh, bless. Okay. She's lived a different kind of life. This is the, <laughs> this is the heavenly scent brush. Nope. Heavenly skin brush from It Cosmetics. I don't even know. I want one of these deals is what I want because it's a cream, a cream foundation. Oh, Lord. Jesus. Okay. So, we're going to do a little bit of this and then we're going to do a little bit of this. Okay. See, I'm trying to dupe out the Kevin Aqua Skin Foundation, like foundation balm thing. I'm trying to dupe that out because I love it so much, but boy, howdy, she's expensive. I don't know if this is going to do it. It does not have the same coverage upon the first application that Kevin Aquan does, but, um, that's not bad. Let's try it. I mean, we just want to try it out. So there were different shades, but it was not a great shade range. However, I don't know what the actual shade range is like from the company because all Honest Beauty was in was just a, a small end cap. So heavens only knows. I mean, there was hardly any products there so that is likely not the entire line but uh there were probably 10 shades maybe maybe 12 i don't know i can't remember but it was not a lot it was not effusive okay there was not too many um you'll notice i have some things on my eyes i'm filming another video at the same time as this because i'm like a youtuber now actually it's because i have a backlog of videos i need to film and so i'm kind of combining some things together okay some strange things are happening in the pan see the bumps i don't know what that is it's like jacqueline hill lipstick oh, i'm just kidding i'm not getting on a microscope don't freak i don't know what this is i'd say the color match is not too bad it is peachy this one is a peachy one but it's not too bad what you think sis I don't go up underneath my eyes with my foundation because I use concealer. So I don't want a lot of product kind of built up. I think that's mighty nice. It doesn't look, let's get close though. Come on. Actually, that's really nice. It doesn't look cakey at all. Like I, back in the day, you remember the compacts of, of cream foundation that was like lobbing it on. This is not that. This is not that. I'm just going to cover one more time some of my darker hyperpigmentation places. Some people think fondly of them as freckles. I do not. I look like freaking, I don't know, Gomez. <laughs> I'm not looking, I'm not looking so fresh here without under eye concealer and with some darker cream shadows on my lids, but it's going to be fun. I'll show you what it looks like at the end. Have you tried this? Are you drawn to this? Is this something you might enjoy? 
Let's get a little on my chin here because I seem to not have, there we go. I think tapping with this brush does a good job um, because it, it deposits more of the product and presses it into the skin as opposed to kind of dragging and pulling it. I think that's mighty nice. It is not as full coverage as Kevin Aquan. It is, it's not, but that's mighty nice. What do you think? Do you like it? Tell me what you think. Again, this is the color Snow. All right, here's the final look with this foundation set with a bit of Laura Geller balance and brighten in porcelain, not buffed in, just a little bit. And then some, you know, bronzer, blush, and highlighter on. Um, I think this is lovely so far. If it wears as well as the Kevin Aquan, I am happy. Do y'all want to see like a, a like a swatch of the colors? They're very different colors. So here's the Honest Beauty in Snow. Y'all, there's legit like hard bubble things. Who knows? I'm probably, my face is going to fall off. It's okay. There's Snow. So a little bit peachy yellow, right? Like a little bit. Here's the Kevin Aquan Foundation Balm in FB01. We hold them up together as well. See? Well, they look similar there. Let's see here. This is much, much creamier than that. There they are. This is the Kevin Aquan. That is the Honest Beauty. Similar consistencies. Kevin Aquan is creamier, smoother. And there is the worrying, um, this is the packaging, no. There we go. You have to get it. You have to hold your mouth just right. So this, I, I mean, the the hard things in it. I don't know what they are. Let me rub on them some more. That's what she said. Mm. I don't know what that is. It's smooth. It's smooth when you go to put it on. So I'm okay with that. I think I like something like a this, like a like an angle. That's just. Disgusting. Someone please help me wash my brushes. Something like that to, to you know, to kind of get it on uh, and buff it in a little bit as what I think would work well. I like this. I'm glad I picked it up. Have you tried this? Are you gonna? Do you want the Kevin O'Quan but you don't know that you want to spend that money? Then pick this up, sis. Bruh, pick it up. I love it. Thanks so much for watching. Y'all have a great rest of your night. Okay, bye.